It was in the time of Buddha, Sakyamuni. Manjushri went to the assemblage of the Buddhas. Buddhas means not that he went to the, to the political parties assembly. That he didn't. He went for a satsang. No, no. Wherever people are with a smile, the people who have got the energy to hug the trees. And then you get the resistance power. Everybody knows when you hug a tree, the tree becomes healthy and you get the resistance power. That is medicine, spiritually medicine. That was the assemblage of the people. You see, you can see Buddhas. When you see a person talking to the birds and the animals, our Irapa is here. My children call him Tata means grandfather. He, he is always on the lookout for the varieties of birds in our ashram from the emu to the peacock to the geese, ducks, guinea fowls, varieties of chicken, cats, every varieties. Sometimes they intend to get locked with the war between Russia and Ukraine and Europe goes and then make sure that has not been happening. And my children used to tell, Europe morning will come, Tata will come morning, the grandfather will come morning and till evening he'll set, evening before going he'll go and talk to the Imu bird, he'll talk to her, he'll talk to all the birds, he'll tell them in his own Telugu language, please climb up, please sit and all the birds understand. That is the Buddha, that is the assemblage of the Buddha. He is a Buddha, means an enlightened person. An enlightened person is a person with love, flowing waters, fresh waters, stagnant waters, that love is very important. <laughs> <laughs>